Well, good morning to all our King Street kids out there. Uh, so lately, we have been talking about calling. We talked about that last week in our King Street Kids Q&A. And so I thought I'd share with you this morning a story about God calling a young boy by the name of Samuel. And it's in the Spark Bible. And it's in the Bible in 1 Samuel 3, 1 to 18. So the story... God calls Samuel. Samuel was a 12-year-old boy who lived in the temple with a priest named Eli and learned about God. Eli took care of Samuel, and Samuel helped take care of Eli because Eli was almost blind. One night, something special happened. So there's Samuel right there. As Samuel slept in the temple, he heard a voice call out, Samuel. Samuel thought it was Eli calling, so he jumped up from his bed. Here I am, Samuel answered as he went to Eli. I'm here because you called me. But Eli shook his head. I didn't call you. Go back to your bed. So there's Eli there, I guess, a little groggy. Samuel woke him up in the middle of the night. So Samuel did as he was told and fell asleep quickly. A little while later, the voice called out again, Samuel. This time, Samuel was more tired and crawled out of his bed more slowly. In Eli's room, Samuel rubbed his eyes, scratched his stomach, and said with a yawn, I'm here because you called me. Eli was getting tired of Samuel coming into his room and said more firmly, I didn't call you. Now please, go back to bed. When this happened a third time, Eli thought to himself, Aha! It must be God who is calling Samuel. Eli told Samuel he was now very confused and sleepy. If you are called again, just say, God, I hear you, and I will do whatever you want. When the voice called again, Samuel did as Eli told him. It was God, and God had many things to say to Samuel. Even though he was only 12, Samuel wanted to serve God. With God's help, Samuel grew up to share many messages from God. People all over Israel knew Samuel as God's trusted prophet. Prophet is a messenger of God. So there you go. So I hope you enjoyed that story about Samuel. And remember that God calls each and every one of us to do different things in our lives. Um, and sometimes we hear that call and sometimes we don't hear it on the first try, but God continues to call us all throughout our lives. Whether we're young or old, God is always calling us. And so like Samuel, we should try and listen as best we can. Hope you have a great day. Take care.